I think the question about the conference of adding value, I think, is very necessary. I think, um, in a big way, it has contributed to giving these teachers a new vision about the changes that are required to be made. Um, the fact that they are able to engage on thought-provoking topics um, will serve to give them a better understanding of how to keep up with trends that take place in the tourism industry. It also further serves to strengthen the importance of how to prepare the learner for the workplace. Besides that, we have a very big responsibility to reduce unemployment. And through the topics that were discussed, discussed at this conference, we were able to strengthen knowledge for the subject, but also to give a new perspective and a new thinking about certain aspects. So I really think it's valuable, and I think it is necessary that this, be, this program be extended to all other provinces and to teachers that offer tourism as a school subject. Uh, this conference, it's, it's really important for us as Northern well Cape teachers. It has developed us to have a good ideas about what is happening around the province and also it has assisted us in order for us to keep it in a practical way to give the learners information that some of us as first time teachers and other experienced teachers, we did really benefit out of it. Ek het verskrikkelijk baie geleer hierdie week um, by die conferentie wat aangebied is. Ek begin nou meer soos een expert in my vakgebied voel, van assessering tot by aanbieding tot by uitstapies reel. Ek voel baie meer selfvertrouwe en baie gemotiveerd om terug te gaan klas toe en dinge anders te doen. Um, tot voordeel van my leders, ek kan nie wacht om weer in die klas te kom nie. En ek wens dat alle onderwijsers in die land die geleentheid kan kry om dit te ervaar. Hey, my name is uh, Mr. Soban Umerso Julai from Newport Combine School in Newport in Pixliga Seme. I attended this conference, which I think it was very, very much fruitful. Uh, because from the first presentations from the stakeholders of tourism, they brought a, a, a bigger picture of what tourism entails in relation so that as the educator, when you, tour, when you teach the, the learners, you, all, you already know what the learners can end up to and what the, 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 the tourism can provide. And also in terms of the methodology and the strategies of in terms of the classroom and how to uh, administration, how to set the papers, we were well equipped. I think it was very fruitful. And for the uh, teachers, uh, for, the, for the South South Africa as a whole, I would recommend that if the other ed educators can be part of this conference, as they will go out there and be better person in terms of information and knowledge. Thank you. I've enjoyed this conference so much and it has truly been fascinating, exciting and it has sparked my curiosity in so many ways. I've realized that tourism is not the subject that fits into the box, but it becomes alive out of the box. I've realized that there are so many opportunities in the world of tourism and, and that there are truly no limits, only the limits we put before tourism. Thank you. Okay. You sure? Because some of the teachers, we don't normally go over the CAPS document. So as of us who were here, it was so much helpful, so much. What a job. Um, let me use this opportunity and greet everyone who's watching the video. Uh, sitting here is Mr. B. Ndike. I'm a tourism novice teacher from Pixley Kaseme District. Um, the conference was very, very beneficial in a lot of aspects. Uh, when you go to the admin side of the subject, it's a very broad subject and I think it just equipped me better with skills to execute the subject nicely and productively to all the children. This conference was very fruitful, fruitful to me because I've gained in a lot of information, knowledge and the confidence also of how to tackle some issues within the classroom. So I think this was not a waste of time. This was very important for all other teachers to have come here and get more information about the subject. Mm. Mm. The conference itself was very interesting, mind-blowing. 
with all the information that I got from you, yeah, the IT guy, um, the time zone, which I'm a little bit scared to, um, little bit scared to teach grade 12 because of the time zone. But now I, I feel that I, I can do it. I, 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 I can. I have all confidence that I thought time zone is difficult. It's not difficult because I doubt myself. So I feel that I can go out and teach my learner and be brave enough to teach them about IT and all work. Even set the question paper after what I learned. To rest my is my ongelooflijke lekker vork. It's my lekker as onderwijzer om het aan te bied en my kinders in die klas geneer het net so baie. Ek het vandag of in die konferentie weer geleer hoe nodig ons mekaar het dat toerisme nie een eiland is nie, dat ons al die sektore betrokke maak en dat ons mekaar nodig het om van Zuid-Afrika beter plek te maak. En ek het weer oude vriende gesien en nieuwe vriende gemaakt en ek het in die konferentie ook my IT-vaardighede geweldig opgeskerp. Ek het nou meer tyd om minder te Ek het meer tyd om minder tyd te spandeer aan my tabelle en meer tyd om te focus op die inhoud van dit wat ek wil aanbied. En ek sien daarna uit om weer in my klas te wees en dit wat ek geleer het te kan toepas. Student Cape Tourism Educators Conference was a very, very amazing conference. I've learned so much at this conference, especially how to set um, proper exam papers and also how to communicate properly with my learners. This was also a conference where I learned how to use excursions in my, um, outside my classrooms to make my lessons more effective for my learners. I really think that this conference is a useful conference for the rest of the educators in tourism in South Africa. Thank you.